my YouTube is Donis. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a V's type beat step by step. I know it's been a long time since you guys have seen me. I've just been in college and taking everything pretty easy. If you're new to the channel, please like, comment, subscribe, and share this with anybody else who'd like to see it. And let's get right into this tutorial. All right, so I'm gonna start by setting my BPM to like 150-ish, 155. Um, I'm gonna get an E piano. Everybody can get this E piano, it's in packs, and instruments, uh, keyboard, and then electric. And I'm just gonna lay down um, just some simple chords. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add a, whoops. I'm gonna add um, a bass guitar. top string i know this one in expand is really good um this one right here the bowed string pad this one's really good Just the one from Purity. This one right here, normal, and then tubular bells. I'm gonna go into my drum kit, um, link in the description. And I'm gonna just get a rim. I'm gonna get this cash gang rim. for the hi-hat village too and then add some little rings. get a short spins this one and then i'm gonna get uh some trumpets i like this producer brass right here uh shout out beats by taz he'd be doing this a lot where he'll like throw the trumpets in the in the v's bees i think it's pretty hard shout out him i think that's it for the drums and the uh melody for all the sounds 
I'm gonna double click on any of these rectangles and do control L and it'll route everything in here. Then I'm gonna hold control and left click over all this and drag them down. And then I'm just gonna level everything out. with this uh, knob right here just the 808 hitting in the middle of the mix and then I'm gonna go into these sounds and get an EQ and start taking out some of the lows so I'm gonna get this band right here and roll off some of the lows do the same thing and just kind of just using your ears just so you know like how I'm doing this and now the 808 has more room because the 808 on this, on the uh, EQ, will hit right here. So that's why we just remove the low end from the melody so the 808 can hit. The drums already hit high enough, so these don't really matter right here. But the melodies, you want to roll off the low end. I'm going to right click, do split by channel. I'm gonna rearrange these a little bit. I like to have my 808 on top, my hats, and then my perks. Um, we're gonna play around. Uh, we're gonna shift click on the top, shift click on the bottom, and drag this on. And I'm just gonna extend these, do control B. Um, I'm gonna play around with the octaves, so I'm gonna hold um, shift click all the way down to the 808, and then it's gonna. Do boost about one. Like that and the layout really up to up to you how you want to do it. Um, I usually just have like a like a four or eight bar section right here, and then I have like kind of an intro, and then I have kind of just the sixteen bar verse. <laughs> the 16s 16 bar verse 16 bar verse um the last thing i'm gonna do is throw my throw my tag on Damn, Donnie made this. i'm gonna make sure on my tag i go into the mixer around my Donnie made this. my tag also throw some delay on my tag um, I have no clue why it's like this um, I'm gonna put the timing to 8 turn the wet level down Damn. and then I'm gonna use this knob so it fades out Damn. faster final beat.